is crazy. I know I do I do even say that's crazy. Who's <laughs> in the basketball game going? Oh yeah. A bit like crazy. Somebody got him something to sip on for his session. What's this? Carmel Macchiato. Mm. You're my little caramel macchiato. <laughs> Double shot. Oh, this for me, please. You the one that's all around. I don't know what <laughs> the hell is the tail? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, yeah. And later go up to the... I guess the second one? and chips and the guy he was so nice he explained the whole menu to me so I got the secret combo that has chicken shrimp and fish so you can try them all and then I did the dirty chips I opted for the truffle parmesan chive and parsley the fries was huh, the fries was fried but the shrimp maybe it was the batter I don't know. And for Gordon Ramsay to be British, I, I don't know what I was expecting. I'm on a date with a chocolate man. Again, I, I keep meeting him. And it's crazy, but <laughs> go crazy. But he agreed to go on a romantic date with me to Brio. And look at this view, it's so cute. Look at my chocolate man. Ooh. I mean, I like, I like the, the light treatments, I like the linen drapery. I like toffee. I like toffee. what? I like Let's see what we want on this menu. How was Rio, baby? Rio was banging. It was really good. It was tasty. I'm glad we made reservations because we should have. Yeah. Oh, look, the sun's going down. Look so mountainous. We, we do. I think we're gonna go for a walk. I'm gonna get out of this silk shirt. <laughs> Good morning. We are about to check out, and we spent less than 72 hours here. And I have to say, Harris was a cute experience. Now my cons are literally why I'm still standing in here right now. The room. Now here's the thing, as you can see, it's super spacious, okay? But they gave us a smoking room, okay? We didn't ask for a smoking room. Mm -hmm. And they said it was based on availability. I don't believe that. The tower that they put us in, I believe we're in the Soka Tower. There's about three or four other towers. Um, the other ones are nicer. So I'm kind of like, why were we in this tower? Just saying, I, I don't know. Soka Tower, mm -mm. you might want to do Creek or Mountain, okay? Because those, oh my God. It was beautiful. Also, um, I have to say this room, like I said, is spacious, but it's a little dated. I don't know if it's because it is a smoking room. I have no idea, but people who do not smoke, you definitely should ask them and have some on reserve. Jeff's taking a shower, which makes me think that shower, the water, the temperature was beautiful. Housekeeping, they answered and they came right up. I was like, ooh, okay. Also, the temperature is temperaturing, meaning, 
And if you want it on 75, you can change that thing to 75. If you don't, you can change that. And I like that because some hotels that I've been to, you can't change your temperature. It is what it is. There are over, I think, 16 floors. We were on floor number nine. The elevators, we didn't have no problems with that. You do need your key when you're using the elevator. And like I said, it's a little dated because they don't have the USB ports, but they do have a bunch of outlets in here, which is great. They also have um, a refrigerator. They have a microwave. You have space to hang up anything. You have like a little couch if that's what you need to use. fan of late checkout okay i called to get a late checkout and they were like okay it's an additional fee checkout is at 11 but if you want to check out at 12 it's 20 dollars. check out at one it's 75 check out at two it's 100 i've never gone to a hotel where they ask for coins for a late checkout but i guess i get it because this is a casino and a resort and people are coming in left and right everybody was super nice and i really really appreciate it caesars they kind of give a chick-fil-a in terms of service okay it was like how can i help you what do you need we can figure it out for you and i was like oh okay then thank you rule of thumb get valet i can imagine i don't know where the parking is i can't tell y'all about the parking at all i have no idea get the valet quit trying to find the parking deck we are on the way out of cherokee what did you think of the resort oh it was nice the pizza was good anyway. pizza was good the truffle fries were great they had 50 million Starbucks. Can't say you were thirsty. <laughs> Brio, huh? Chicken. Oh. oh, so good. I guess we're going back toward Maggie Valley. We're going back to Maggie Valley. You can't make a right turn here. We gotta go left. Interesting. I think. From what I've seen, there's nothing in Cherokee like that. Baby, if ain't no Target anywhere near, I don't need to be here. So we gotta get out of here. We gotta be good. Now this is gorgeous. Look at the clouds. It's beautiful. Somebody ran up in there trying to get away from something else. Perfect. <laughs> That's all I've been thinking about. It. Like, what's up in the mountain? I mean, somebody said I want to be off the grid. All in all, enjoyed the resort. It was chaos checking out. Not in a bad way, but it was just like people coming in, people leaving, valet. Oh my God, it was a lot. So I didn't get to do like my last overview of my pros. Would I come back? Definitely. Um, is it family friendly? Mm, no, I didn't see a lot of kids. No, I, I don't think it's for children. It's definitely if you were here to gamble, chill out, drink, have a good time do all the things okay there is so much food <laughs> so much food you cannot say i was hungry you cannot say you were hungry or you didn't have anything to drink you can totally bring your own drinks your own food there's so much to do um didn't do the pool or the spa they have a spa but all in all you can get your steps in please make sure you are bringing your um sneakers with you okay or some shoes that are very comfortable i bought my heels and didn't even wear them okay it's real chill too it's not real extra it's real chill but i liked it would i be back would i come back here definitely did i prefer Asheville over cherokee i can't say that because both of them have their pros and their cons i still enjoy Asheville for the biltmore it's a totally different experience so i can't really say go here or go there but if i can say would you should you go to cherokee to the Harrah's casino and resort yes check it out why not i, I think it's cute definitely out of the way honey and it's beautiful scenery beautiful now the only thing i would have changed we would have left a little earlier to get here because we were over the river and through the woods child and that drive in the dark is something else <laughs>
but it was cute. I enjoyed myself.